how important hydrating well in the summer is. Drinking enough water is the number one focus. Want some water? Yes. You want flavoured water? Yes. Yes. Lemon and pomegranate? Yes. Yeah. Some more lemon. Yes, that's good. That's good. Here you are, Hannah. Take. Thank you. That's enough. My point being that we need to get to drink water ourselves as, as much as we can, need to help our children hydrate as much as we can. What happens when you're not hydrated well enough? Um, one thing that happens is definitely low energy levels. I mean, when you feel lethargy, when you feel just tired, it is probably dehydration. Another thing people face is constipation. I mean, you may be eating a lot of vegetables, you may be eating a lot of salad, but maybe you're not drinking enough water. Another thing is it affects your skin. Your skin needs water to stay hydrated and to stay, um, you know, fresh looking and not dry and dull, you know. So if you want good skin, drink that water. Now here comes an important one. Metabolism uh, tends to slow down when we are not hydrated, when we don't drink enough water. What does that mean? It means the body burns less calories when it doesn't have enough water, if it's not hydrated well enough. Many women suffer from uh, you know, water retention, uh, they, they feel bloated. Now, uh, interestingly, water retention um, happens also because of dehydration. So the, the body tends to balance. So when it doesn't get enough liquids, it doesn't get enough water, it stores water. And that's what water retention is. If this video is helpful, hit the share button and share it with a friend.